like and subscribe right now or you're going to have bad luck for the rest of the week. Cats are cute, furry, and one of the most common house pets in the world. Although you may not know how to interpret the meow, mew, and the meow, and even know how cats stretch before they fall asleep, they're more complex than you would imagine. Even if you own a cat, from training humans to the richest cat in the world, here are 10 bizarre cat facts that'll blow your mind. Number 10. Cats train humans, not the other way around. Do you ever find yourself playing servant to your cat? Maybe you're working on the computer, and your clever cat lies down across the keyboard to get your attention. Next thing you know, you're stroking the cat instead of striking the keys. The loud purring that follows is music to your ears. Cats are able to train humans to do whatever the hell they want because they're so darn cute. The cuteness is an innate quality they've evolved for the sole purpose of attracting human slaves. Cats also know us. You've probably noticed similarities between cat cries and human infant cries. When we react positively to our cats and therefore oblige them, we get the chance to know them a little bit better as individuals. The relationship between the feline and the human species is a matter of give and take. Some cats seem to take more than they can give. Sometimes it does seem like we're at our cat's every beck and call. But really, would you have it any other way? Number 9. Scared Pet The ancient Egyptians were absolutely fascinated with cats, and it's thought that most ancient Egyptian families kept at least one as a pet. Cats were often used on hunting trips to fetch birds and fish from marshes around the Nile River. They were probably brought into houses at first because they caught rats and chased snakes away from their home. However, they soon became even more important to the lives of ancient Egyptians. They looked like something of spiritual importance and were considered sacred animals with magical powers. Ancient Egyptians believed that keeping a cat would protect their home and bring them good luck. Several gods and goddesses were associated with cats, the most famous of which was the goddess called Bastet. Bastet had the body of a woman and the head of a cat. Bastet, known as the household goddess, was responsible for mothers, children, pet cats, fertility, and dancing. Due to their link of the goddess Bastet, many ancient Egyptian cats were mummified. The popularity of the cat grew during the ancient Egyptian period, and it was a common motif on jewelry, ornaments, and amulets. Even the penalty for killing a cat in ancient Egypt, even accidentally, was often death. No wonder cats, even these days, are so high maintenance. Number 8. Healing Powers We think we know what a cat's purr means. It's arguably the most recognizable sign of animal contentment. A pleasurable rasp that erupts whenever a cat is tickled or pet, the soundtrack to countless sessions sprawled on an owner's lap, but that's not quite the full story. There's a lot more going on with a cat's purr than you might actually expect. First of all, not all purring indicates pleasure. Cats also purr when they're nervous or in pain cats purr even when they aren't injured. Many domestic cats purr to indicate hunger. Scientists have also found that a cat's purr also has healing properties. A cat's purr frequency is exactly 26 hertz. This frequency corresponds with the frequency that scientists use in vibrational therapy to promote tissue regeneration. Vibrational therapy creates healing and reinforcement using low frequency vibrations instead of high impact activity. So theoretically, a cat's purr can help the healing process, but it's not just about healing bones. The healing power of cats can work in a number of magical ways, like lowering stress and helping to ease difficulty breathing in both cats and humans. A cat's purr can also help in lowering blood pressure. Didn't know that, did you? Cats are pretty strange, but they're amazing. Number seven, cats can drink salt water. While you won't be refreshed by a glass of salt water, your kitty actually can be. Feline kidneys can filter out the salt from the water, which allows them to consume and rehydrate by drinking salt water. While it's safe for your cat to occasionally drink from saltwater pools, and while they can tolerate higher salt intake than dogs, this does not mean that they should consume large amounts of salt. High salt intake can lead to excessive thirst, urination, or even sodium ion poisoning. So although your kitty can tolerate low amounts of salt water, always provide them with plenty of fresh water to prevent high consumption of salt water. If your cat drinks too much salt water, consult with a vet immediately. Number six, same walk as camels and giraffes. Yeah, we all know this one sounds wild, but hear us out. Cats walk and move with undeniable grace and elegance, 
You might have never thought to compare their walk to any other animal simply because it's very feline-like. However, camels and giraffes actually use the exact same walking sequence. They all move the right front and hind feet first, followed by both left feet, moving half the body at once. Cats, camels, and giraffes are the only known animals to walk this way. How interesting is that? Number 5. Disney Felines Disneyland is home to some unexpected residents that might give Mickey Mouse pause. The famous park is home to more than 200 cats. According to the Cats fan site, and yes, there is one, the feline invasion of Disneyland began in 1955 when Walt Disney Company had to evict them from Sleeping Beauty Castle. Those cats were adopted by cast members. The adorable feral cat colony lives in the happiest place on Earth. You must be thinking, why is that though? Well, due to the theme park's rustic design, Disneyland had ironically brought in unwelcome guests to the park, rodents. The cats found their wonderland inside the park with a good source of food, the rodent population. Plus, the park was a place free of the typical dangers that a stray cat faces. They would come out at night and hunt inside the park in peace. The administration picked up on this and let them stay inside the park. The idea worked so well that the cat population at Disneyland still exists with over 200 felines. And apparently, they're doing a much better job than the human exterminators. Number 4. Stubbs the Mayor A demanding yellow and orange hedonist with zero qualifications elected in a bout of anti-establishment protest despite having no experience, no platforms to speak of, no real power, and no opposable thumbs. This was Mayor Stubbs the Cat leader of Talkeetna, Alaska, for nearly 20 years. With apparently the bare minimum met, the residents of Talkeetna were content to let their furry mayor traipse around the town, drinking catnip spike water from stemware and taking meetings at the general store, which happened to be his office. Mayor Stubbs' only demands were attention when he wanted it, and interference when he didn't. The stalwart mayor survived and kept up his career until he died four years later in 2016 at the age of 20. Number 3. The Biggest Cat in the World There are cats, and then there's this Maine Coon kitten. A cat so big, it's often mistaken for a dog, and despite its size, the feline hasn't even grown all the way yet. Yulia Menina, who lives in Oskolin, Russia, owns a cat named Kafir, which has been dubbed the world's biggest cat, and it's not hard to see why. She bought the Maine Coon kitten two years ago. And now she says most people think her giant white cat is actually a dog. The cat is just under two years old and might actually have a few more years before he finally stops growing, according to the New York Post. While the actual length of Kafir isn't known, it's clear from the images that he's a little longer than your average house cat. Just imagine it following you around in the middle of the night. <laughs> I'd crap myself. Number two, cat dementia. It's not just humans. Cats can get dementia too. Also known as cognitive dysfunction, cats that are lucky to live a long life may experience some level of cat dementia. Geriatric cats that appear to be confused could be experiencing something more specific than just old age. Feline dementia is a tricky disease and is sometimes underdiagnosed, undertreated, and misunderstood by veterinarians and pet parents. Now that cats are living longer than ever before, it's becoming more prevalent. Cats with dementia show signs similar to humans with senile dementia or Alzheimer's disease. The feline aging brain often starts to show signs of wear and tear between the ages of 10 to 15. The typical signs of cat dementia include generalized disorientation, reduced activity, and decreased interest in playing, reduced interest in food, water, and changes in the sleep-wake cycle. Number 1. Tommaso, world's richest cat. This black cat was very lucky. In fact, the luckiest cat in the world. Tommaso was taken over by an elderly Italian lady named Maria Assunta from the streets of Rome. She left a fortune of an estimated $13 million to the feline when she died in 2011. The woman's former nurse said, I promised her I would look after the cat when she was no longer around. She said the woman had no idea how rich the woman was and wound up being asked to care for Tommaso after Assunta passed away. The nurse also said she wanted to be sure that Tommaso would be loved and cuddled. Money like that can buy a lot of cuddling, that's for sure. However, Italian law does not allow animals to directly inherit a sum of money. Did you already know any of these facts? Have you ever seen your cat acting bizarre? Eh, we know you have. 
let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more amazing content. Thank you so much for watching, we'll see you in the next one.